hey guys welcome to the channel hope everyone is doing fine thank you for stopping by thank you for being part of this journey we really appreciate you guys i must say okay today i'll be teaching you guys python programming there are loads of programming languages out there you have your python you have your java you have your javascript you have your sql there are quite loads of them so today we'll be talking about python programming so if you already have your python python downloaded on your machine so you just have to go to your search bar click on python um, and to come to come up if you have a look i see i'm using 3.10 it has so many versions and this is the latest version of python programming it has 3.9 3.8 so i'm using the the recent version which is 3.10 so today we'll be talking about um Okay, before you start running any program, you have to create a new file. So, if you go to your file section, you click on new file. The reason for this is, this is your editor and this is where you run your codes. So, you, you must have this open. You must have it open. So, we have this open. You click on file again on your right hand side. You need to save as and uh, save it in one of your one of the folders in your in your laptop so i'm just gonna choose maybe document i would say um python python trial python dot trial you can just give it any name doesn't really matter so this is python i'll save it it's there up there python dot trial py so let's assume i want to draw a pentagon and the and the, a star this is like i'm giving it a command what what that's what about about programming you give it a command you tell it what it, what it needs to do and it's going to do that so far you give it the correct command so i'm just gonna give it a command to draw a pentagon and then um, a star so you should start by you need to import turtle so turtle is already is inside them and Python. So you need to import Toto. Um, yeah, import. I need the other way. Import Toto. So this is a command you're given it. So it needs to import Toto because it's a graphic. Because this can only take place when you, when you import the Toto. So I've given the command that turtle needs to be imported. So you press enter. So you do dot t dot turtle. Always give a space. So t space equal space turtle dot turtle. Bracket open and closed. Enter. T dot forward bracket open and closed so i'm the number i'm giving it now is the sizes of what i want it to be because i want to draw a pentagon and if i start so i want i'm just giving the size whatever size you want it to be you can give it so i want a hundred so i'll go to left t dot left Bracket open and close. My left is going to be 72. Yeah, yeah, 72. And enter t dot forward. Bracket open and close. 100 is going to be. Enter. The left is going to be 72. So. Closed enter t dot forward bracket open and closed and red enter t dot left. Yeah, this can be quite a long, um, a long process. But what can you do? All this needs to be done for, for you to have your output. So t dot left, I want my left to be 72, so you have to carry on. 
72 and the next one is my forward t dot forward which is 100 so it remains 100 bracket open and close enter t dot left yeah so you see here that noise that noise comes up when you press the the, the wrong tab so i've mistakenly pressed the um, closed bracket tab when i meant to press the open bracket tab so that when the noise comes up when you press the wrong thing instead of the right thing so i'm just gonna press the bracket open so it's supposed to be 72 bracket closed enter so t dot forward which is 100 so we'll carry on forward 100 enter so let's see dot left bracket open and close 72 enter t dot pen up the reason i'm bringing a pen up is when you're drawing something when you stop for example when you're drawing your star you put the pen up so you don't leave a trail back to the plain, you know, to the plain side. So you put your pen up. So it's a command. Pen up. Bracket open and closed. Enter. T dot S E T X. Open and closed. Enter. T dot Pen down. Yeah, so when your pen is up, you can always you have to always bring it down. So pen down, close, T plus. Now this should be the size of the pen. It shouldn't be too thick. The draw the graphic it shouldn't be too. So I'm just gonna choose size three. So it's gonna be three. Enter. I'm gonna choose the color T plus pen color. Yeah, one thing here when you come to when you're using Python, remember this is an American. This tool was developed by an American, so and they use American English to you know to develop it. So you have to always use American English. So it doesn't accept British English. So in this case. You have to also make sure your color is spelled in American way, which is there's no U in color in America. So I'm just gonna remove the U and put R. So always take note of that. So pen color. So I want the pen color to be blue. Let's say uh, I'll call the function blue. I'm gonna close the bracket. So T plus fill color. Because when you use the color, it's easy so. so you have to always make sure you fill up the color. So open and close. So yellow. Yellow. Is a function, so I need to call the function. Press enter. So T plus begin underscore fill bracket open and close enter T dot forward bracket open and close hundred. T plus left. This I want this one because I'm drawing a star, so it needs to. Um, I will say one forty four closed. So T dot forward hundred. Mm. Forward hundred. Enter. So my left 
140.left which is 144 so i carry on with 144 till enter t dot forward open and close i want it to be 100 so t dot left is 144 enter t dot forward forward is 100 one thing about this is you have to be very careful so you don't you don't put a wrong one and also make sure you don't put more than the sizes the side of the graphic you know pentagon pentagon the size of the pentagon you know the star you know the side the, the, this how many sizes the star has so t dot left which is 144 144 bracket open and close t dot forward forward because 100 and t dot left because 144 t dot forward 100 T dot left one four four close T dot the end. So you have to always make sure you call the function T dot end to know that's the end T dot end because failure. So bracket open and close. So once you've done this, you have to make sure you have the sizes all complete. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's it. So we're just gonna run this and see. You should open up on a different window. Okay. So for this thing to come up, I mean I must have I'm just gonna have a look at my command for the star let me see one two three four five six yeah that would Okay, let's see what it says there. Missing one requires argument X. So it's telling us it's when it when something goes wrong, it gives you the error and tells you what really happened. So line 14. Let's have a look at now on line 14. So we we'll have to count one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So this is where it happened. So let's see. Who could have Okay, I've seen what happened. It's 200 there. So we're gonna run it again. I've made, I've amended the error and see what's coming to come up. Okay, now we'll have it all done. Okay guys, thank you all for watching. You all have a good day. Bye.